It is full steam ahead for congestion pricing. Today, the MTA board held its final vote on who will be exempt from the surcharge. News for Andrew Siff live outside MTA headquarters in Lower Manhattan with what it means, Andrew, and also the last ditch attempt to prevent it from taking effect. Right, David. This has been in the works for five years, ever since the state legislature legalized congestion pricing in 2019. A long road, a lot of hurdles. But as you indicated today, the MTA board has now approved it, which means barring a court order, congestion pricing will start charging cars and trucks to enter Manhattan south of 61st Street, including where I'm standing in lower Manhattan. Promised for years as the solution to gridlock and an antiquated subway system. Give us the tools. We'll get it done. The MTA board took a vote today. Strongly, yes. This is a true victory for our city and for our region. With a lone opponent. I'm voting no. The motion is approved. The 11 to 1 passage means congestion pricing gets the green light unless there's a court order. Cars face a toll of $15, trucks between $24 and $36, starting June 15th. The only exemptions, school buses, commuter buses, and essential government vehicles. We're not talking about commissioners' vehicles. We're not talking about elected official vehicles. Those are specifically and categorically not exempt. Commuters in the nation's largest mass transit system have been promised the $15 billion raised by congestion pricing will modernize the system. We'll see. We'll see if it happens. I'd love to see it. Drivers have been told their new expense is worth it because roads will be unclogged. We have to adjust. Hopefully the overall cost of living will increase. But opponents pointing to next week, that federal court hearing a lawsuit from New Jersey leaders and the New York City Teachers Union, whose president predicts gridlock will move to other neighborhoods. Quote, it is going to be up to the courts to prevent the huge environmental injustice. The court process has been scheduled to be resolved before we are going to start congestion pricing. We're, pretty, we're, we're very confident about the outcome. The MTA chairman optimistic that court hearing one week from today. We're live in lower Manhattan. Andrew Siff, News 4 New York.